hi everyone good morning and welcome to a new vlog a travel vlog as you can see from the uh, from the title i'm excited i don't know i'm excited and i'm nervous i don't know okay i know why share but anyhow welcome to a new vlog can you guess i don't know if the title is going to have where i'm traveling to or not i'm not sure i think so i'm not sure shall i guess in the comment section if it doesn't have a title or even if, if it doesn't have the location in the title but yeah welcome to a new vlog today is wednesday and i'm sorry if you can hear the background noise there are like churches around and they are in session so yeah it's currently like almost 12 p.m i am ready my i'm currently in my elder sister's house um salma is here my mom and my younger sister are on their are, are on their way here i just told them to help me stop at the mall to buy power bank and a neck pillow so yeah how is it how do i feel i don't know guys i'm i'm excited but like i'm nervous i'm more nervous than excited honestly because it's just like i'm traveling alone i've traveled alone before like i travel alone all the time but i haven't been to this country alone and it's just ha <sighs> okay but well, it's going to be fine inshallah oh let me show you i'll show you guys my boxes apparently i think i've well you know what i'm not going to go into that whole story here because i think i must have mentioned it in my other vlogs but i'll show you my boxes i have one 23 kg box and one 10 kg and one like backpack with my laptop and my documents what else i think that's pretty much all the yeah we are waiting for we ordered for i'm so annoyed actually yellow plates i i mean i've honestly not had this experience with them before so i'm so irritated we ordered from them in the morning around 8 a.m guys 8 a.m and they literally told us that we were the first order for the day we ordered for food because i was like let me just eat like one more meal that i'll enjoy before i leave and it's currently past to 12 or even 12 o'clock and the meal is still not here guys two hours later we called them and they were like oh we're having maintenance issues why didn't you tell me you were having maintenance issues you could have easily told me oh sorry oh, we're having maintenance issues i don't know if you want to place this order and you it will take a while or nigerian business is honest you need, you need to do better i don't know why for some reason nigerians feel like if you lie it's better but if you lie it only makes the customer more angry if you if you tell me the truth and i'm like oh no i don't want this service it's fine but they would rather lie to you collect your money and you'll be angry and insult them and then they'll not be telling you sorry 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 like does it make it make sense anyhow let me show you my guys my luggage this is my luggage this is my oh my 23 kg bag but it's weighing 25 kg i'm going to just like guys it needs to be sorted out it's going to be sorted out at the airport this is supposed to be my 10 kg i i'm actually allocated 8 kg but this weighs 10 kg so i don't know it will be fine sure then that is my backpack which has my jacket in it but the goal or the plan is once i pass through check-in that jacket is going in here because nobody has the strength to be carrying a backpack that's full like that oh yeah aisha is also on her way here because she slept in apple in her friend's place she's also on her way here and yeah i'll see you guys later Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make coast collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you Dripping the 
Hey guys, so I have fully checked in. It was a long, it was, I mean, it was, actually it wasn't long. I came, I got to the airport around five. Hold on, let me drop you guys. My hands are, my hands are pinning me. So as I was saying, I got to the airport around, I think five, maybe like 4.30ish, five, no, like past five. And then we tried to, Come in. Rabi and her husband dropped me off because she had to go to work and he went to drop her off. She's on night duty. So he went to drop her off at work and then it was me, mommy, Aisha, and Hibatela. We tried to get in. Obviously, they were not going to let everybody come in, but you know, mommy now, but like mommy, mommy stuff. So she came in with me. I said bye bye to Aisha and the rest of them. Guys, Aisha started crying. Uh, hard girl. Okay, Aisha, she's not a hard girl. She had Aisha started crying. I was like, ah, yeah, how can we bye bye you? Hug me, Aisha, you have to leave me alone. <laughs> and then she started crying. And then I started crying. And then he was like, started crying. Most of my the only idiot I did not cry, Aisha. But Alhamdulillah, mommy followed me in. I I, I think I'm going to insert clips because they recorded it on their own phone. Um, also, I was going to send it to me like via Google Drive, I think. And then what else? That's pretty much it. Mommy followed me in with my bag my bag was like guys i hate traveling with luggage i hate it with so much passion my bag was 26 kg and it's supposed to be 23 kg so i had to reduce things from inside my main box to my 10 kg see now like my handle can't come like it can't come all the way up because there's so much load like pressing pressing like where the box comes out from and guys this is not my box it's my elder sister's box if she watches this video she's going to be like eh, hey, if it's for my box you'll buy me a new one shasha i'm talking too much basically i had to re remove things put it into my school bag hold my jacket in my hand and then reduce them into this place checked in mommy said my goodbye to mommy and i'm currently at gate seven i don't know if you guys have seen it gate seven we're supposed to check in at um border gate seven a well my flight is still like a very long time ahead so when i'm done here i just want to sit and make like phone calls i might go and find somewhere to eat i'm not sure yet but we shall see hold on okay we shall see i might go and find somewhere to eat and yeah that's pretty much it that's the update for today i don't know where guys i'm not even traveling i'm looking for it. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me call who I need to call, and yeah, this is. Guys, so I came to get something to eat, and I'm getting a sandwich and shrimps, and yeah, basically that's just it. Yes, so basically I came to get something to eat and I got a sandwich shreds you guys already know how much I love shreds I like the Chapman and the Mojito flavor and I also got water how much did I spend? I spent 5600 I mean obviously I bought food literally like but it's fine I'm, I'm hungry but like I'm not so hungry I don't want to eat anything that will give me heartburn. My um, gaviscon is in my box that I checked in, so I don't want to eat anything that will give me heartburn. They had it like warmed up. It's the chicken sandwich. I mean, it's okay, but I'm not a big fan of sesame seed, and it has like sesame seed all over it. My it's okay.
Hey guys, so I am currently in Frankfurt. We landed like maybe a few hours slash minutes ago. I'm so tired, I swear. What else? Yeah, basically we're here and the flight to Toronto is around nine something. I'm not sure actually what time it's going to be, but Shasha, I'm tired. I didn't sleep well. I actually didn't even get to, okay, but I slept sure, but very, very uncomfortable because the plane we entered was very small. The plane was very small and uncomfortable. And then one lady, Nigerians, we always, they're just very annoying. One lady made me forget my neck pillow and I literally just bought it today. Oh, well, yesterday. Mommy just bought it for me. She was coming to come and meet me at my sister's house before we went to the airport. Mommy bought it for me for Miniso. And the lady was like, when they wanted to check my bag, I was trying to lift it up and hold it. The lady was like, oh, let me hold it for you. Ah, you know, bless us with something. Those kind of things now. And just try, and my box was like really full. So I was trying to close it so it doesn't open. And in all of that, I forgot. I'm, I'm annoyed. I didn't even realize until I got to the plane and the chairs were, were uncomfortable. I was trying to sit. I was trying to like find it with my neck. And then I realized that I forgot it. But it's okay, Sha. Thank you. Thankfully, my wait is not long. I'm waiting for the people that are supposed to be traveling on this flight together. I'm waiting to see them. Yeah, I want to call Om Salma now on FaceTime so I can just gist for a little bit. But yeah. Hi. guys i just quickly came to use the toilet and i don't think i did like an outfit check all through my trip but this is it okay i did well i did like a get ready with me on tiktok so i guess you can check that out i'm so tired <clears throat> I wasn't able, I don't know if I should realize what we had for like, is it lunch? We just finished eating, they gave me one food that I don't even understand. It was rice, but I didn't understand the rice. I shall eat it like that. And, oh, I'm tired. I'm tired is an understatement. But, I just came to pee. I hate using, I hate using, um, in toilet so i always try to like hold it in and pee only once like my flight from nigeria to frankfurt i peed only once this one now from frankfurt from from frankfurt to canada hopefully this is the only time i'm going to pee yeah hi let's go out now We are in Canada. I don't know if I okay. Well, I, don't, I think this is the first time I'm mentioning it. I actually came to Canada. I I have moved to Canada basically, guys. I'm going to give you like more like tea in the future, but I just landed. I've been through immigration. I got the whole welcome to Canada, and I'm like, I'm currently at Starbucks because. It is currently like 2.40 something, almost, oh actually it's 3 o'clock already, but my, I'm actually not still staying in Toronto, by the way, they, call, they don't call it Toronto, they call it Toronto, I don't know why Sha, but I shall did Toronto, you get the gist. I'm in Toronto and I am going to London, that's where my friend is, it's also a city in Ontario, but she booked a ride for me and the ride was for 5 o'clock I think because obviously she just wanted to make sure that I got to immigration on time and all of that so I'm just going to be here chilling and waiting for him I have texted him where I'm going to be so that he will just he will come and pick me from here I want to now, I'm charging my phone with my power bank 
I stopped to get food. I got like a chai latte and grilled cheese sandwich because that's like the most basic thing to get. I changed. I don't know if you guys can hear me. Hopefully you can. I just changed like hundred like US dollars. So I'll just have a little bit of cash on my hand. My friend already like paid for the ride and all of that, so I don't necessarily need to do that. I wanted to get a SIM card, but I decided to just wait when I get to her place tomorrow. I'll just do all my work. Hey guys, so I don't know how I even have energy to end this vlog, but I want to end this vlog here. I just got to my, whew, I just got to my friend's place, Amina, and she's not around because she went to school. She's on her way back. She left food for me to eat and all of that, but <laughs> see this bed. That's just what I want to do. I just want to like. Thankfully, like I was on my period this trip, so I just want to like freshen up and sleep. That's all I'm going to do. I wanted to write my to-do list for tomorrow, but I don't even have the energy. But yeah, guys, we are in Canada and we're going to start up a new vlog tomorrow with all the activities I need to get done. I hope you enjoyed this watch. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, as usual, give the video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button um i don't know say a prayer for me that this new journey i don't know just turns out well inshallah and i'll see you guys in my next video bye